Welcome to the QuickBooks and CypherLab Scanner Setup Tutorial. You'll want to obtain an 8000 series scanner driver from tech at cypherlab.com and download to your computer. Have your Windows computer ready with QuickBooks point of sale installed. Verify that your computer is 32 or 64 bit by using File Explorer. Right click on this PC and then click on Properties. Have your 8000 series scanner docked in the cradle with the power supply connected and the USB cable connected to your computer. Once your file is on your computer, you're going to want to right click on it and extract all. Click on extract. Once the file has been extracted, double click on the folder and then select the executable Likely your computer is 64-bit, so click on 64.exe, and this will launch the installation wizard. Click on Next, then click on Accept the Agreement, and Next, then select Finish. Close out both of the folder windows. Then in the search bar at the bottom, type in Device Manager, Click on Device Manager once it pops up. In Device Manager, you're going to click the drop down next to Ports. And notice the Silicon Labs is COM6. In this example, it's 6, but yours will likely be COM3. Right click on it and click on Properties. Click on Port Settings, change 9600 to 115200 click on it and select OK. Again note that it's COM port 6 and we will verify that COM port 6 matches up to QuickBooks. So in QuickBooks click on File, Preferences, and Workstation. Click on Physical Inventory Scanner and note the COM port. Again in this example Device Manager shows COM port 6 and QuickBooks shows COM port 6. In your case, it may be COM 3, but just verify that both of them match up. Now click on Test Physical Inventory Scanner and follow the next steps to test your device. Take your 8000 series scanner and in the main menu tap on 1 to collect. Scan the barcode of an item, verify that it scanned, and then select a quantity of one. Tap the blue key to enter, and then hit escape to go back to the main menu. Now what you'll want to do is tap on the number two to upload. Dock the device in the cradle. And then on QuickBooks, click on Begin Test. Once the test is successful, it will say Test Successful. You'll want to close that window and make sure that you click on Save. Thank you for watching. If you have any additional questions, email tech at cypherlab.com.